Imagine a scene where wine flows freely, like water from a fountain as people gather around, eagerly filling their cups with this precious elixir. Such a captivating sight might seem like a dream, but in 1660, it became a reality in the form of the wine fountain. This marvelous invention or rather a temporary installation brought joy, laughter, and an abundance of wine to all who encountered it. The wine fountain, with its generous offering of free wine, can be seen as a testament to the lighter side of history, reminding us that even in the past, people sought enjoyment and humor. The origins of the wine fountain can be traced back to the year 1660, in the city of Oliva, located in what is now modern-day Poland. It was during a grand festival, known as the Feast of Corpus Christi, that this unique installation made its appearance. The Feast of Corpus Christi was a significant religious celebration observed by Catholics around the world. However, in Oliva, the festival took on an extraordinary twist with the introduction of the wine fountain. The wine fountain was designed and constructed by an ingenious individual whose identity has, unfortunately, been lost to history. However, their creation left a lasting impression that has echoed through the centuries. The fountain itself was a beautifully crafted structure adorned with intricate sculptures, majestic columns, and ornate spouts from which the wine would flow. It truly was a sight to behold, a marvel of engineering and artistry combined. On the day of the Feast of Corpus Christi, the wine fountain was unveiled to the excited townsfolk and festival attendees. As the wine began to flow freely, a wave of cheer and merriment swept through the crowd. People eagerly lined up, their cups held high, ready to be filled with the precious liquid. Laughter filled the air as friends and strangers alike indulged in this unique opportunity to savor fine wine without constraint. The wine fountain became the centerpiece of the festivities, attracting visitors from far and wide. It soon gained fame beyond the borders of Oliva, as tales of this extraordinary sight spread throughout the region. People traveled from neighboring towns and villages to witness the spectacle, creating a sense of anticipation and excitement wherever the news reached. The wine fountain had become a symbol of celebration, a joyful oasis amidst the daily struggles of life. The wine fountain continued to flow for several days, bringing joy and lightheartedness to all who reveled under its spell. However, like all good things, it eventually came to an end. The Feast of Corpus Christi concluded, and with it, the wine fountain was dismantled. Its temporary nature added to the charm leaving behind only memories and stories of a time when wine flowed freely from a fountain. Today, the wine fountain of 1660 lives on as a legendary tale, shared and recounted through the annals of history. It serves as a whimsical reminder that humor and laughter have always found a place in even the most unexpected of settings. The image of a free wine fountain remains etched in our minds, symbolizing joy, abundance, and the comical side of humanity.